The alpine tundra is the world's highest biome and can be found across the globe at altitudes ranging from 13,000 feet at the equator to 3,000 feet at northern latitudes. Today, the alpine tundra is sought out for its recreational value through hunting, fishing, and hiking. The vegetation of the alpine tundra consists of low and slow-growing perennial grasses, sedges, forbs, and wildflowers. There are no trees due to the cold average temperatures. Up to 90% of the biomass is contained in roots as energy stores to survive through the long and harsh winters that can last from September to May. The main reason the vegetation of the alpine tundra is important is because the plant communities prevent soil loss from wind and water erosion, which helps maintain water quality. The alpine tundra is a very important source of water in the western United States. The biotic communities aid in water filtration and soil erosion. The ecosystem function can be threatened by human interference. For example, outdoor enthusiasts leaving designated trails can have a detrimental impact on the sensitive plant communities. Recovery from this abuse may take decades or even centuries. Another indirect threat to the biome is found in climate change, mainly in the form of greenhouse gases. Nitrogen emissions are being carried to these remote areas, altering the fragile ecosystem. Warming from climate change increases the elevation in which this biome can be supported. Moving forward, it is imperative for recreational users of the alpine tundra to be mindful and limit the impact they have. In order to do this, users should stay on maintained trails and use existing campsites. Today, most alpine tundra is federally protected through national parks and forests to limit human use and mitigate degradation. Additionally, long-term survival would require a unified effort to reduce carbon emissions by switching to alternative energy uses. Practices like these will ensure the survival and enjoyment for generations to come.